select one. Okay. So to run the race five simulator, first we need to know the page for simulator repository. So in here spike is called spike risk 5 isa simulator it is on the github and we need to set up our environment first by using this commands first we need to install the dtc device 3 compiler and then we create a directory and configure and then we make so first we have to clone the repository We have cloned the repository and we move to the directory. Then we install this device tree compiler. Sorry, sudo. And then we create a build directory. And then we move to that path. And we will configure. And in this step, we have to define where is our RIS5 directory. So, in this example, we will use. Um, sorry. We have to make first. This is our installation directory of RIS5 toolchain. Let's use this. Okay. After configure is done, we can then make the spike. Minus G16, it's the processor counts. So if you have processor with 32 core you can use minus g32 okay so after we have the spike we compile using make and we install it using make install inside it will be installed in the default directory that we already defined before in here we have risk 5 demo so it's now the spike is installed should be able to be run by using by calling the spike binary here we have spike risk 5 simulator 
and then we can check spike to run our binary here I have a simple hello world and we need to compile this using the RIS5 GCC that we already installed before it's called RIS5 GCC and And then we have our binary a dot out. Um, but before we run the binary, we need to have a kernel. So since this is um, user program, and it needs a kernel to run the printf. So in Spike, it can be it is compatible to be used with RIS5PK RIS5PK is a proxy kernel and bootloader for RIS5 and it is also contain the Berkeley bootloader PBL which is a supervisor execution environment for the RIS5 system we have to clone this repository first in here we make a new one and uh, uh, no, no. clone make it pk demo we clone in PK demo and then we go there and we have to build the PK so make their build CD and then configure in this part we use the same directory with the spike and, and the host is RIS564 because we will we will compile the application as 64 bit application this one elf 64 bit And then configure finish we make the binary it will take a long time uh, okay finish and then we have to make install and now the PK is already inside this directory RIS5 demo RIS5 64 unknown elf binary after that um, we can run the spike using this one spike pk and we can directly run the executable this one we have now we have hello risk 5 is shown so this is how we use the risk 5 simulator to run user program